Welcome back everyone and I'm here again with SBR contributor Jordan Sharp. Today we're going to be looking at how those odds have been acting up for the game between the Pittsburgh Steelers and the Atlanta Falcons. How you doing today Jordan? Doing good Dax. Thanks for having me back man. It's my pleasure man. All right lines makers opened this one up favoring the Steelers at minus three and since then that line's dropped to minus two and minus one and a half in some cases. Five times today I've seen that they've been doing weird shit man. They have them at pick them right now. All right now we go on and we see that the Steelers clobbered the Bengals last week 42 to 21. The Falcons brought up a nice game against the Packers, but still lost it 37 to 43. Now the Steelers are eight and five straight up and six and seven against the spread, while the Falcons five and eight and six and seven against the spread also. Um, dude, I don't know. I mean, I like what Atlanta's been doing so far, and I think that if they can actually put up the pressure and continue to pass the ball, they might upset the Steelers, and the Steelers really need this game if they want to get into the playoffs. What do you think, man? Yeah, that, that Atlanta defense really holds the key to this game, I think, because they looked pretty good for at least a little while last week against the Packers. So at home, I think you have to think they're going to show up at least a little bit. But um, secondary, I think, still very beatable in Atlanta, despite their run defense playing better. And Pittsburgh's going to be able to take advantage of that. I think you and I both said it last week. We called Pittsburgh kind of finally busting out of that little mini slump they were in, uh, beating Cincinnati last week. You know, I, I – I, I want to trust Atlanta. I just don't. And even though they, they're still playing for something, you know, they're still not a great football team. And now uh, they have some, you know, their, their receivers are a little banged up right now. Um, they really can't run the ball. And, and I think Pittsburgh here on the road, um, you know, to laying one and a half with him is not ideal, but I do think it's the probably the play for this game if you're looking to bet on it. What do you think? Yeah, I think so, man. I mean, I think it's uh... – uh, Roddy White was a little banged up, and Julio Jones still has that that hip issue. That uh, I don't know if he's actually been cleared or not to play. Uh, have you heard anything about that one? No, because that's a huge one too. Julio Jones single-handedly knocked me out of uh, my fantasy playoffs <laughs> last week, and it looks like he's still listed as questionable right now. So probably going to come down to a true game time decision with Julio. I mean, it just doesn't it doesn't really give you any sort of confidence in the Atlanta Falcons here. I think it's just one of the reasons why I think if you're going to play this game, you got to fade them here. Yeah, I think so, man. I mean, the way that Bell has been running the ball and, uh, you know, Antonio Brown catching it and Martavis Bryant, you know, those guys right now have been doing really good stuff with uh, Big Ben and all. I'm thinking that the Steelers are going to win this one at least by, you know, a touchdown. I, I think that they can actually win it by a touchdown. And, hell, I yeah. mean, right now with the line that uh, Five Dimes has at a pick em, that I think that that's the best way to go, don't you think, man? Yeah, a little bit of juice at minus 125, but I agree with you. Yeah, I think it's uh, I think it's probably one of the better wagers um, of these of this early game slate for sure. Yeah, yeah. All right, dude. Nice talking with uh, with you, and uh, let's do this again uh, soon. All right, thanks, Dax. No problem, man. And for SBR picks, this is Dax Floyd. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns, big money free betting contests year round a real-time Vegas-style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.